the students of Canterlot High School, are good at different things. Rainbow Dash is a good runner. Percy is good at delivering mails. And when Edward is not doing any work, he's very good at being a backup student. When students have heavy loads, Edward comes to their side and helps them on the job. But Edward is old. Some students think this makes him unreliable. Edward is a useless old steam pot. He should be retired. But he doesn't have tires. Retired means taken out of service. And not a moment too soon. The other students agreed with a dodgy o dazzle, but Pinkie Pie was very upset. Later, Percy asked her why she looked so glum. The Dazzlings don't think he's useful anymore. Pinkie Pie told him about Edward. Percy saw Principal Celestia, and told her what Pinkie had said. I will attend to the matter immediately. Principal Celestia had a plan. The new hallway to the computer lab is completed, I want you to teach Starlight Glimmer how to go there properly. But, madam, who will look after my loads? Sunset Shimmer will handle the work. When the other students heard Sunset Shimmer was going to help them, they were pleased. Sunset Shimmer is very reliable. It makes no difference to me. I don't need a backup student. Edward enjoying working with Starlight Glimmer. It was great fun testing the new hallway to the new computer lab. But Sunset Shimmer was not happy. The loads were too heavy for her to carry. Sunset Shimmer found herself going slower, and slower, and slower. Halfway to the office, her legs stopped altogether. Sunset Shimmer was stuck. If I stop on this hallway, I'll never get started again. Adagio Dazzle tried to set off again, but with Sunset Shimmer's heavy loads as well as her own, she couldn't budge. It's no use, we need a backup student, I'll send for Edward! Adagio Dazzle was cross. But Edward was excited. He was going to be the backup student for two loads. Edward cheerfully collected some of the loads, and the cavalcade set off. Look at that. The backup student must be the strongest and the best. Adagio Dazzle was embarrassed. Principal Celestia spoke severely to Adagio Dazzle. You have said rude things about Edward. He proved today that he is useful, reliable and very helpful. Adagio Dazzle felt very ashamed. The next morning, Adagio Dazzle apologized. Thank you for helping me Edward. You really are a useful student. It's good to be back. Principal Celestia's plan had worked. There was no more talk about Edward retiring. Thank you for helping me Edward. Sunset, I was sorry about what had happened last week. Can we be together again? Of course Edward. Let's go on a hayover with my friends to the mall. Good. That's settled. A friend helps a friend.